two teams for the first four games, and here we go with game number five on EA Sports. A lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Back to the point it goes. Makes the save on the slapper. Here's a chance, and that was stopped. Delayed penalty looming. The Mallards will play it from the defensive zone. Odd man rush. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Yakupov's going to serve a pair for interference. Make me to course, man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. First power play opportunity of the game, and also a chance to dictate pace if they can go ahead in this one. Oh, what a smart heads up play. The Nationals will kill off a few extra seconds now. Oh, he hammered him on the play. Oh, this Come is on. just a thunderous hit. Talk about physical engagement. and he does tonight. Oh, James, these are the types of goals that everyone loves because they provide energy. It's determination. It's being relentless on the puck. And he's falling to the ice, and he still manages to get a sick on it. No one knows he has the wherewithal to shoot the puck and still get it off, including the tender, and that's why it goes by. Magneta Gorse's efforts pay off as they get the game's first goals. We inch closer to the midway mark of the first. Yeah, and they're inching closer and closer to more goals here as they get the first one of the game. And sometimes scoring is a struggle, James. But when you put one by the tender, often it comes in bunches. Oh, man, he's so dialed in. Makes consecutive saves there and keeps his team in it. And he loses control of the puck. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. Well, they have the lead, and now they've taken a penalty, so now they're going to be back on their heels. That power play's going to come out. You know they're going to be smelling and tasting blood, James. The PK unit, they got to be to task. Power play unit comes out for the faceoff. Well, they create a power play opportunity with hard work, and now it's an opportunity to get back in this game, James. Finding a way to move the puck quickly and create seams to get shots on net. Moves it to D. To his teammate! Shot denies him in close. What a fantastic save from a high-danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Change. There's no one happier than the coach right now. They'll be looking to keep that momentum going here in the faceoff. After that last shift, James, where they really press, they want to continue right there, get pucks to the net, because this goaltender will not want to battle net front. He's outworked already. Moves it to the middle. Oh, he comes up on a stop. With possession along the wall. Quick feed to Durgachov. Quick shot. Oh, off the iron. The Nationals, Ben showing some fresh scores! And the kid comes up clutch here in the postseason. Oh, he does it, James. Gets his first playoff goal. I mean, it's incredible the confidence that this should give him. I mean, the pressure and the stakes are high, and he delivers. This is exactly why you send bodies to the front of the net, James. You want to create a screen, and the goaltender drops into the butterfly position as a default and is battling to find the puck. Can't find it and beats him clean. Here in the late going to the frame, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And they grab possession of the puck after that center ice faceoff. The Mallards take it along the wall. Oh, what a 
Impressive save, James. And I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position, it's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out battling, and out willing everyone around you. Shoot. Here's a pass in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. And with that, the first period is in the books. Both teams with a chance and a refresh will get a clean sheet of ice and come back with period number two. Both teams had a chance to recharge, and the officials set to drop the puck here on period number two. Looking for that go-ahead goal here as the play is underway in the second. All right, Pounder, how would you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? Magnitogor's performance in the first period was lackluster. They didn't generate any offense, and they weren't attacking with any kind of speed. They're going to have to find a way to shore that up, James, because their opponent is really taking it to them. They're fortunate that this game is still tied. Takes a shot. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Moves the puck along the half wall. Scores! Rips it off the pipe and over the net. Wow! They almost needed a double take there, James. When you hear that sound, sometimes you think it's out, but this one goes in. When you hear the ping, you certainly know that you've beaten the goaltender clean, and this is what happens here, but it doesn't come out. It goes in the net. Make Nita Gorse gone up by one here in the second period. Well, it's been a lot of hard work and heavy lifting to get to this point, just to get that one goal lead, James. Not only do they want to hold on to it, they want to extend it now. Dees won the draw here in the open ice. Over the line they come. Great ball check on the reach. They score! for the net, James. When you get in tight and you're sniffing around, you better get that puck off quickly because you know there's defenders all in around you that are going to come and close. Make need, of course, now up by two here in the second. They've really pushed the pace this entire game, James. It's going to be a question as to whether they can really close it out. And the first few strides have been urgent. That tells me they've been prepared right from puck drop. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Here's a shot. Scores! And that's three unanswered goals. And as my mom likes to say, they're cooking with gas. <laughs> they're cooking with gas. And you can expect that they have put their opponents on their heels. This is a team that knows that they have worn their opponent down. Now they've got to keep the pedal to the metal. Make need of course on cruise control now, up by three in period number two. Well, it hasn't been a dominant performance, but they've gotten the job done, and that's why you play the game, James. They're not winning in terms of analytics, but they found the back of the net. And off the face-off, they take possession. Looking to make something happen along the boards. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. The Mallards will serve two for slashing. Another scoring opportunity looms here. Although it's been a frustrating power play, they have to find a way to open the ice up. If they can have quick puck movement, they're going to cause the coverage to stay low. And that quarterback up high can let one rip. Make need, of course, got a hold of it along the wall. Takes it across the blue line. Here's a shot. Oh, a spectacular save right there. Wow. Attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. Excellent stick work on the play. Here he is in close. Oh, and he gets a piece of the puck to deny them there. 
A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender in a task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. What a hit on the play! Oh, my! Yeah, you clearly knew what he was doing here. He got all of them, tags him, knowing full well that he's going to disengage that puck. <laughs> I love it. Comes up with the stop. Missing Kent's gained possession along the boards. Nice zone entry on the left side. Player goes down to the ice. There's the referee's hand in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty on the way. And the body language on the bench says it all, James. They're all looking up at the time on the clock to see if they'll continue to run because they got to kill off this penalty when they're down a bunch of goals. Another chance here on the man advantage. They haven't scored on the power play yet, but they have another opportunity. The key to this one, gain possession so they can set up. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive setup. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Approaching the final 60 seconds here in the second. Cuts to the front! Gets a piece of it with the glove! This is an impressive save right here, James. I mean, there's a ton of net front presence, and so a lot of traffic that he has to battle through to find the puck, and he does, and he makes a nice save. the horn bringing period number two to an end 40 minutes down 20 to go third period action is coming up two down one to go third period they're ready to drop the puck it's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third let's see if anything changes Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? Magnetico has been terrific through 40 minutes of play, but you know the coach is going to be preaching that full 60 minutes to be consistent and see it right through. So they'll have to be defensively responsible, but when they can be on the puck, be hard on it. Sends the pass over. Great reach with the puck check. And makes the save. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Durganshoff's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. On the one-timer. Referee's hand shakes high in the air. Looks like he scores! And I guess they won't need that power play after all. Well, it's a delayed call, and it almost looks as that the defensive structure collapses. And man, do they take advantage. What a play. Great hand-eye coordination to be able to time that and tap it down. Nizenkamp's had plenty of opportunities, but they finally get one here in period number three. There's been a lot of pushback. They've had the puck on their stick. Now they're going to have to look to attack. They can feel like they're in the game because they finally are. The Nationals win the faceoff. Takes the shot. Stops him cold. officials to make as the opponent goes falling to the ice at the hands of your stick. Tough one to take. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. 
Power plays, more time on the ice, the ability to get that puck moving. These players know exactly what they're doing. They work on it in practice. Spoke to some of them earlier today at the pregame. And they talked about the execution and the precision in particular with their puck movement. Here's a chance to set up now. Moves the puck. And Luke scores! show up in the video room tomorrow there's no question about that because it had it all puck movement motion and urgency on retrieval which i think is absolutely critical yes gotta start with the puck if you want to find a way to get the shot to the net and it winds up in the back of it Magnet, of course, his offense continues to shine here in this third period. Well, this has got to be a dream for a coach. You know that they're telling their team in the intermission to make sure they stay to business, stay to task, stay focused. And that's exactly what they've done, and they just hammered their opponent. Puck is dropped, and play resumes. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. Magnet, of course, won the draw.